Hey, if you're using FSD's latest and greatest for hardware 3, 12.6.3, you need to do this right now. Because I heard from so many people that after doing that, let me just tell you, camera calibration, you will get a very different performance from your FSD. So what you need to do is go to your setting menu, go to your service, and then hit that camera calibration. And your car will take some time, you need to drive a few miles, and your car will be calibrated. And then FSD will perform much better. But we are gonna test something new in this video. I'm gonna engage it right now. And we are going from point A to point B, and we're gonna see how Tesla FSD handles this situation. For some reason, the car is going to the left a little bit, though there was no snow on the road. Though it was, there was few snow on our left side, but the car decided to go to the left and going from there. Really don't know why the car decided to do that, but we are proceeding, as you guys can see, there are few snows on our right side right now. We're gonna stop on this stop sign. The car seems very cautious. And also, if you are not familiar with me, my name is Anato Mohamed and I love to film Tesla full self-driving videos in New York. And after these few cars from our left side, we can make this right turn. So let's find out. Very good job. Immediately proceeded without any hesitation. Let's see. You see that after immediately making that right turn, the car decided to move to the left lane. This is what I noticed in this 12.6.3 version of latest and greatest for hardware 3 that after making that right turn the car immediately changed the lane and moved to the left side so we are proceeding guys also if you are new i would really humbly request you please hit that subscribe button that will help me a lot as a new content creator let me know in the comment what kind of video you want to watch and comment about the video quality what you want to uh, prefer what i should change or anything like that just comment below your opinion you know that matters a lot because i really want to improve i still know that I'm, i i'm not very fluent in english so that's a very uh, big lackings from me and I probably sometimes can't explain everything properly but I'm trying guys and now we need to stay in this left lane because we're gonna march on this upcoming stop sign so for that we need to stay in this left lane and also change another lane and move to the left side one more time so we're gonna see when FSD decided to do that very good job immediately change the lane and come over here we need to stop for this stop sign behind that white line and if there is nothing on the opposite side traffic we can proceed it should proceed right now definitely it should proceed right now okay very good immediately proceeded no problem at all perfectly done guys uh, i know if you're familiar with my channel you know this location normally i do narrow road testing also unprotected left turn critical unprotected left definitely but in this video we're gonna test just uh, you know like uh, if we engage fsd from point a to point b can it take us from point a to point b without any human interaction so when i engage fsd i didn't have to press that acceleration today what i need to do was just sit and observe because this is a supervised fsd we are still not in unsupervised fsd so what we need to do is just supervise if anything happens i just have to take over but other than that i didn't have to do anything if you are if you are seeing this watching this video i didn't have to touch the steering wheel at once now we're gonna make a left turn but we need to wait for this traffic light I didn't like that because the car crossed that white line and we have very narrow space on our left. If there is any other car coming and trying to make a left turn, he will have very little space. So I didn't like that the car passed that white line and then trying to go after the light changed. So just want to put it out there so you understand where the car is in a hurry, right? Also, we're in a hurry mood, by the way, guys. So I just want to put it out there too. Also, FSD is saying, Full self-driving may be degraded because of the bad weather. But my camera is clean, my left side, right side is clean, my back camera is also clean, but still the car is saying that going a little fast compared to my taste when making, you know, um, a curvy road turn or something like that. But still, 
the car makes that turn a little fast I really really don't know why it should just de decrease the speed a little bit um, so one more time guys my name is Anato please hit that subscribe button that will be amazing for me so I'm gonna um, end the trip here I'm, I don't want to make that right turn but let's see if the car tries to do it if this is a community I don't want to get in so I'm gonna just keep driving and then uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the destination somewhere else so let's do it guys so engaging FSD for the second time perfectly done immediately turns on the indicator and move to the road very good from the park position um, and then cleared the windshield uh, for some reason really don't know there was no rain or something but it's still the car preferred to do that uh, probably for be better visibility but it's still um, I didn't feel that importance because the windshield looks very clear also now we are stuck on this stop sign or red light traffic light and now we're gonna make a left turn here guys so this will be a 10 minutes drive uh, we passed like five minutes without any interaction and the second time is like five minutes too so 10 minutes uh, let's find out if FSD can handle it so we just have to wait for the traffic light the light changed we can make this left turn as you can see our car is making this left turn without any problem without any human interaction guys so we are gonna play a game right now guys because if you're familiar with my channel you know in my recent videos I started playing a games with you guys so I'm gonna tell you a number I'm gonna tell you a number and you're just gonna comment below that number so that I will know that you watched this video until now so the number will be what should be the should be the number guys i'm very confused because i almost like used all of the numbers so the number will be three so please write down three in the comment or whatever you want in this comment section that will help the algorithm to push my videos to more people thank you so much so now the number is three okay so we stop for the stop sign one more time we're gonna, you know, wait um, until our uh, from the f f like forward car moved on, and then we can proceed. Okay, the car decided to, you know, trying to go a little left, but there was a car over there, just because of the snow. I can realize that in the road over there, right over there in front of us, there was some some, you know, like snow over there. So our car was trying to avoid that, and then uh, you know, like it doesn't have that much of space on the left side, so it just uh, did it uh, without, you know, slowing down or moving to the left and then we are proceeding the sun is directly hitting in the cameras also guys so hopefully the car will be able to see I see everything without any problem um, so we're gonna find out how when and how the car changed the lane to make a left turn we're gonna make a left upcoming traffic light so we are proceeding we are going the sun is directly hitting in the cameras it's still now very sunny but it snowed yesterday in new york we're from new york by the way guys it snowed a lot yesterday if you saw the outside camera you realize there are so much snow in the road not in the road exactly the side of the road carve and stuff like that but still there are snows the road are wet but our car is performing without any problem like the car fsd making every turn every navigation looks very easy we're gonna make a left turn here but we need to wait for the traffic light definitely so yeah guys if you're enjoying this content please i humbly request you hit that subscribe button guys please thank you thank you thank you and yes we are waiting for the traffic light guys car wants to go I can feel it like it just wants to like hey I'm gonna go but yeah we are not running any red light and now the light changed we can definitely make this left turn very good job okay slows down after making this left turn a little bit there was a little hesitation it touched that YOLO mark on the road um, it could just do a little wide wide left turn but decided to make that left turn little you know like little you know close to that other road so we're gonna test unprotected left turn right now because we almost getting like no human interaction point a to point b but i want to test some unprotected left turn right now just for you guys because we are here right so we can definitely do few unprotected left turn guys so let's do it 
So, unprotected left number one in New York, and the sun is directly hitting the cameras. Trust me or not. The car didn't even saw that snow at all, probably just went over it. So, we're gonna make a left turn. There it will be. We need to creep to look on our left side, and there will be traffic from our right side, too. So, let's find out how this life is the handles. So, there are traffic from our left side right now, and there are traffic from our right side, too. So, this will be a very good test because. As you can see, after this blue car, we had a little space, but there are two more cars coming from our left. And after this one, we can definitely proceed. Our car started moving. Very good. Immediately make that left turn without any problem. Perfectly done. No problem at all. Perfectly done, guys. Amazing job, guys. So we're going to do one more time, guys. Uh, I tried that first unprotected left turn from a different road. But we're gonna do that critical unprotected left turn right now. So let's do it, guys. So unprotected left number two. I engage it already because this is a narrow road. So we're gonna also see how this left is the avoid snows. And then, you know, go and proceed very perfectly, very slowly done. But uh, for some reason, it just stopped there. It could just go, really don't know why. And now it started moving slowly. A little bit of hesitation. Just have to put it out there so you understand. Um, for some reason, the car hesitated a little bit after making that left turn and then now uh, we are proceeding. And it's still, the sun is directly hitting through those uh, trees in the cameras, but not that harsh right now. And now it is harsh, definitely. And we are proceeding and it's still we are going. This is a very narrow road too. We're going to stop on this stop sign. Look on our left side if there is nothing on our left. We can go straight to make a right turn and make a U-turn. So we stop here. We're going to creep and there is nothing on our left side so we can proceed. Now there are vehicles from our left side. Very good decision. Very, very good. We stopped. It takes its time immediately proceeding now. Very good job there. Now deciding. Okay. Okay. Very good. Came here. Amazing. Because of the snow, it's kind of confusing to, for the car to look and realize the lane mark. But still we are stuck here, really don't know why the car is stuck, there is nothing on our opposite side, there is nothing on the left side, the car is just stuck there, we're gonna make a U-turn, now there are traffic from the opposite side, and now there is also traffic from our left lane, this is interesting guys, we had definitely so much time to make that U-turn, but our car decided to just wait there and now we are making this u-turn very good for some reason really don't know why the car did that but the car did something new today because there were no car over there coming from the opposite side and there are no car from the left side too but it decided to stop there for a few seconds i don't mind at all it just being cautious you know but then it made that unprotected left turn also that u-turn perfectly without any problem very good decision not like just taking a little time is not bad but being you know like very fast and the need to make that left turn without uh, seeing there are other cars coming is a problem but this time the car decided perfectly so we're gonna do one more time let's do it guys protected left number three in new york and we're proceeding this time the car is going little fast very good job there uh, didn't hesitate that much like the previous time and this time it is going slow, but it's still very nicely Now there is a braking here a little bit of you know, like slowing down there and now proceeding the Sun is directly hitting the cameras I need to wear a sunglass from now because the Sun is very harsh to my eyes guys Also again if you're enjoying please hit that subscribe button. We're gonna creep there are vehicle you shouldn't proceed very good job just to stop there you know like just wait for those other traffic to pass and then the same thing like the last time the car will go and make a right turn amazing decision the car's indicator was one and now our car decided to just move on because it realized that we don't have that much space from that lane because it's very narrow and what you're trying to do wow making a space to make this u-turn very good slowing down again confusion again but again making that u-turn perfectly hey future anato here so as you can see there is a truck approaching on our left side and this indicator is on but our car will proceed it without any hesitation because that lane is very narrow so our car just gave a space and now you will see the car makes a space by going right side and then making this u-turn amazing job by tesla fsd guys what do you think let me know in the comment
realizing that I cannot make this U-turn because I have very little space. Last time it did it, but this time for some reason it felt that way. So it made that space moving to the right side a little bit and then make the U-turn perfectly amazing job. Oh my goodness. Today's video was unbelievable. Like I, I just, I can't even explain like, what the car was trying to do it make that a space like moving and you know like when it realized there was a you know like a indicator of that other car making that right turn it realized like okay this is a very narrow road i cannot just let that person in so it immediately proceed and that car slows down and immediately make that right turn and then wait for that u-turn and then make that u-turn perfectly done amazingly done guys if you enjoyed this video please hit the subscribe button and also don't forget to calibrate your camera because this will help for fsd to perform better trust me on that everyone is talking about it on x so please do it on your hardware 3 vehicle and the car will perform much better guys Thank you for watching. I love you so much and have a wonderful, wonderful day.